Here today with Western Michigan senior Chris Lewis. Chris, thanks for joining us today. No problem. And Chris, you recently broke Western Michigan's career hits record. Um, you did that last weekend at Eastern Michigan. What were your thoughts going into this year and approaching the record? I mean, I was just trying to take it one game at a time, see if I can get a couple hits out of each game and see if I can get this done. And uh, you broke Mark Abril's school record that was 239 with uh, your double in game two at Eastern Michigan on uh, April 23rd. You registered uh, the season Mark set that record. Have you talked to him at all about breaking his record? No, I haven't talked to him yet anything or heard anything about it from him, but hopefully I'll see him before I leave here. And uh, when you came here, you were actually recruited as a pitcher, but uh, you're going to leave as one of the best hitters in school history. How did that all come about, that uh, kind of transition? Well, Coach Ford, when he was recruiting me, was looking at a different pitcher at the time, and I was supposed to be catching that pitcher's bullpen. And he went, and then the pitcher never showed up. So he watched me throw a little bit and hit me hit in the cage. And he was more thinking of me as a pitcher than a hitter at the time. And then I came here in the fall, pitched a little bit, and then I saw how I could hit, and he just kind of converted me into a hitter. And you're obviously a switch hitter. Um, when did you kind of pick that up? Was it something you did younger or high school? Yeah, it was, it was when I was younger. One of my old hitting coaches started me when I was about 12 years old or so. He thought it would be a nice tool to have, and I just kept doing it all the way through, and it just kind of picked up and worked out. And what kind of advantage do you think that gives you being a switch hitter? Um, I mean, most breaking pitches will come down and into you versus breaking away. So it's kind of, it helps when pitches come back in towards the strike zone, towards you instead of away. So it helps them find my bear a little easier. And when you're up there, is there a, you know, a side of a plate that you're more comfortable with? Uh, most of the time I'm more comfortable lefty now just because I see a lot more right-handed pitchers than left. And as you're going through these records, you're also approaching some other career records, RBIs, total bases, career doubles. You know, these are records that uh, guys like Adam Rosales, Matt uh, Miski hold. These are guys you know who went on and played in the major leagues. Um, what are you know, your thoughts maybe at the end of the season going pro? I mean, I'm hoping to. I would like to. I've had a few letters, and I mean, it'd be a great, it's a great dream of mine to make it up to the next level. So, and as you finish out your senior season, you know, what kind of do you want to leave behind here at Western Michigan? Um, I don't know. I just want to leave behind like a nice career, like a good kid that played here, and hopefully, I've inspired some younger guys to try to work as hard as I did and perform as I did. Perfect. Thanks for uh, joining us today, Chris, and good luck on the rest of the season. Thank you.